So, thanks for the thousand subs. Also, I'm Wes the Explosion, in case this is the first video of mine you happen to watch for some strange reason. The goal was to hit this by the end of the year, but we're not even halfway through and we already got the rest of the way. Heck, the channel's at 1.02k currently. I may have waited a bit to address this just because I was paranoid I'd make a big thing out of it and then the count would drop back down. I wasn't just avoiding the poll results, I promise, although speaking of, you guys did surprise me. I was expecting streaming the full Mainline X series in one go to win hands down, but instead it's sitting in second, with the video on my top 10 favorite games getting about double the votes. And that's cool. I kinda wanted to do that eventually anyway, but due to poor planning I didn't, well, plan ahead for that possibility. I'm sorry. All the prep I was expecting for streaming was picking a day off, setting up my Switch and waiting room, maybe arranging for a few people to stop by to bring me food and make sure I'm doing alright, then hit go live when the time came. A top 10 list though requires me to assess the thousand or so games I played and narrow it down to just 10. And some of these games, it's been so long since I played them that I also have to question whether they still hold up or if younger me just had terrible taste and has managed to convince current me that it totally is worthy of making the cut. I could definitely crap out a top 10 list, or I could do this right. Go back and at least fiddle with each game that I'm considering, or better yet, slam through a full playthrough. So if it doesn't seem too objectionable, I think I'm going to take a few months to do exactly that and make sure that my list is properly thought out. And since 10 is such a small percentage of what I played and I'd feel bad about some of the ones that I'd leave out in the cold, I might also bump this one up to a top 20, although I'll probably split it up into two videos then, since that's a lot of yammering. I'll be asking for a lot of feedback here, but since this is something I agreed to do with people stuck around, this one's especially important. If you want a rushed version now, just a top 10, or an hour-long deluxe 20 special, I do try to stand by my commitments, so I'll abide by the consensus. Hopefully reactions aren't too mixed. Since I am asking for a bit of a grace period, I was considering making a Discord server as a bit of a consolation. Since that's the poll option with the least votes, that probably seems backwards, but I was kinda considering doing all the options at some point and just letting the results determine how I prioritize them, which, again, probably seems backwards, since it's the last on the list. I've kind of gotten the impression though that it's something I should have done a while ago, and I've just been dragging my feet on it. Part of it's because I don't use Discord myself much, mostly just to communicate with my Extra Life Guild, who I really should touch base with at some point, and to receive thumbnails for my brother. Partly it's because I'm practically a shut-in, who largely teleworks for data entry and spends my free time playing games, reading, or making videos so I can't imagine most would want to talk to me. Wasn't crazy about the Q&A option for the same reason, but hey, we've gotten over a thousand people who apparently think I'm worth listening to, and this would be a good chance to learn Discord anyway, so let's go for it. Since it was a low priority, if I suck at it, at least there's not much pressure. I'll test it out with a few friends, then drop the link in the community tab and Twitter bio. Hopefully this doesn't make the poll seem pointless, I normally stick to them pretty closely when it comes to my streaming channel, but hey, I just hit a thousand subs, I'm still learning. I'll try to be a bit more professional at 2,000. Speaking of streaming, I'm also planning on making a separate channel for highlight videos. I used to do two of these a week, but I've been seeing better retention since I stopped trying to force an extra Sonic or Pokemon video on you. I've been meaning to cut them all together, I just didn't want the algorithm to banish me for going from three to just one video a week, so I figured I'd cycle them out slowly. When I do, I'll probably take a short break from posting them and then make a new channel. I thought about asking if anyone actually wanted this, but I review all my streams anyway, so it's not too much effort to just whittle them down while doing so, and as long as it's not interfering with things here, it can only be a bonus for me there. This is another one that you can keep your eye on the community tab for, if you're interested, and if not, well, thanks for listening anyway. The watch time helps. The last thing I want to talk about is monetization. YouTube told me I could have done this a while ago, but it didn't feel like I was doing enough to justify it. I also felt like not forcing people to watch a random ad for Old Spice or Burger King at the top of the video might also make them more likely to stick around. 
One stopped watching a podcast because the first hour of it was always littered with ad breaks every few minutes, though that was a pretty extreme case. Anyway, I'm still not sure if I want to do it now or at the beginning of next year, because if I'm going to have to do some extra steps for taxes, I'd almost rather it be for a full year instead of half a one. If I did monetize things though, I'd feel more accountable for what I posted and could put funds back into the channel. Stuff like a new computer, software, and possibly commissions. Probably won't go for the Adobe subscription I was previously considering though. So yeah, of course I'm looking for opinions on this too. That's pretty much all I wanted to say. A quick thank you, a rundown of my current thoughts and plans, and just a chance to ask for opinions and suggestions since I do not want it to seem like I'm making promises and then just doing whatever I feel like anyway, according to my whims. I'm not always the best with social stuff, let alone social media stuff. So sometimes I worry how my actions will come across. With all that summarized, thanks as always for watching, thanks again for the thousand subs, and thanks in advance for any feedback anyone's willing to give me. Something 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 for everlasting peace.